This is the Northwest Dyke Project on the Highwood River, one of 17 flood mitigation projects underway in High River, and all but two will be completed by May 15th. Yes, so by May 15th, uh, there has to be something in place for the entire town to protect the town, whether it's completed or um, uh, temporary, something is to be in place. And when I say completed, uh, the goal is functionally complete. We had a flood in 2013. We've got a level of water that happened in 2013. So we're building everything up to that level, plus another meter. Mayor Craig Snodgrass is happy with the speed of the work and confident the dikes will prevent a repeat of last year's devastating flood. We're very confident with um, what's been done since, since June in this town. And, you know, all the dikes and new dikes um, strengthened, lengthened, heightened, everything stronger for this year in High River. And um, there isn't anything that, that we're missing. We're confident of that, and I'm, I'm very confident of that. Snodgrass isn't deterred by criticism from some residents who doubt the dikes go far or more accurately high enough. For some people, sure, it might not be. Build this thing 10 stories tall, like how, do, how high do you want to go? The mayor is also praising the amount of support that's come from the province. We'll make sure that we're ready for this spring and as you can see uh, behind me and all around the amount of dirt, the amount of rocks that are being moved uh, is significant for this town. We're doing everything we can uh, to be prepared and protect the town and uh, I think we're in a very good position. Now it's up to the town's engineers and crews to get the work done before spring runoff. Well, we'll have enough, we'll have all the works in place to protect the town by May 15th. There's still a lot of work to do. In High River, Rick Donkers, CalgaryHerald.com.